Hi Aquarius, I hope you're doing well. So we'll be looking at whoever you're thinking about here for the rest of the year. Well, this is someone Aquarius who has a crush on you and they're having a hard time holding back on their love. Perhaps they were in the past, um, they weren't moving towards you, um, there was indecision, but they're having a hard time resisting the feelings they have for you. See, which strength upright can be someone who has ego, um, they're holding back, it can be anger, which is why I said it can be a lot of things, but it's clarified by the star page of the cup. It's sort of someone who's accepting their feelings for you. And I like how you're coming through in their reading star. This person's hopeful. They're wishing for this to work with you. But hmm, I want one more actually Aquarius for the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Why is Knight of Pentacles in reverse here for the person on Aquarius mind? What it's highlighting is this person was stuck and they weren't giving to the situation. They weren't moving forward. Um, they weren't making a decision. Or that could have been your energy with the Queen of Swords. For your stance, we have Page of Wands upright, Six of Wands in reverse. I think you're curious to see where this can go. It's sort of going with the flow. You're open-minded here, moving forward. Um, there is attraction. They're coming through as the Page of Cups. You're a Page of Wands. Um, perhaps there's back and forth flirting here. Page of... They're pages, though. Let's see. But it's paired next to the Six of Wands in reverse. Hmm. Let's clarify before I talk about this. Why is Page of Wands here for Aquarius? Yeah, Queen of Wands. Yeah, <laughs> we have a pair here. Aquarius, we have the King and Queen of Wands. Um, I think it's mutual attraction. Um, you want to explore these feelings, and I think they do as well. You know, let's see where this goes. Why is Six of Wands in reverse here? Why is Six of Wands in reverse here for Aquarius? There's passion overload here. There may be distance that may be causing you to feel some sort of way. Six of Wands in reverse can be lack of recognition, attention. Some of you may feel you don't, this person doesn't give you enough attention. I want one more, but there can be physical distance here. This may be social media connection for some of you. Why Six of Wands in reverse? Now Five of Pentacles, sometimes you may feel this person leaves you out, but some of you could be missing them. Um, because of the distance. But sometimes their lack of attention energy may have you feel left out is what I'm getting. But you're still interested, you're curious with the Page of Wands. You're very attracted to them. They're physically your type and I think you're physically their type. We have more water emotions in their feelings whereas we have more fire um, in yours. How they're viewing you, Nine of Cups in Reverse, Temperance Upright. The Nine of Cups in Reverse can be feeling drained. Um, they may feel, maybe viewing you as someone who's reliant on them in some way for emotional support. Um, but with Temperance, they're seeing you, see that again, that element of distance. They may be seeing you as someone who's distant, but perhaps someone who's healing. Why is Nine of Cups in reverse here for how this person's viewing Aquarius? Oh, the wow. Ace of Cups, King of Cups. Yeah, they see. Wow. It's temperance here for how this person's viewing Aquarius. Why is temperance here? They may see you that as someone who's a bit unhappy with the pace that things are moving. I do see you as someone who has a lot of love to give, unconditional love. It's overwhelming um, emotions here, right? The uh, cup is overflowing with love. But yeah, they see you as someone who's very patient. You're investing time and energy or you're willing to. But for now, things you're not coming together. There's a lack of stability 
and some of you it can be um, because of the distance I was getting. But you're willing to work towards a solid commitment is how they're seeing you and you're sort of going with the flow divine timing at play here. How they're feeling about you, we have Page of Cups upright, Wheel of Fortune in reverse. They're waiting for the right opportunity to express themselves to you. They may feel external forces are getting in the way of this connection. But we have Page of Cups twice in their energy. Yeah, look at that. Ace of Pentacles. Three of Wands. Yeah, they're wanting to plan with you for the future. This is someone who wants to express love. They're waiting for the right opportunity. Um, they want something. This is a new beginning. They want something solid for you. Some of you, it's a second chance. They want reconciliation. They want communication. This person's willing to invest and see where this goes. Why is Wheel of Fortune in reverse here for how this person's feeling? Okay, this is moodiness coming through. This person has mood swings, Aquarius. Um, so they can sometimes, which is why Knight of Pentacles, Two of Wands, they have emotion for you. It is a small offer of love, but it's definitely something that you can build upon, right? It's a start. But they are moody here when it comes to you. Why is Wheel of Fortune in reverse? <laughs> Wheel of Fortune upright, definitely up and down when it comes to their emotions for you but they want this what action they're taking towards you king of wands two of wands yes beautiful um this is someone who wants to pursue you they will be wooing you here and they are taking action towards you um king of wands is fire energy they're taking action they're planning if there's distance they're wanting to plan um to come see you or you see them why is king of wands here for what action this person's taking towards aquarius this is a solid action coming from this person, um, which you know when you watch tarot readings, it's rarely we get something positive or someone's taking responsibility, or, you know, coming forward. Six of, uh, Ace of Swords, they, they're going to be pursuing you. They're, they'll be communicating with you. They're taking initiative. Usually King of Wands is the pursuer, so if you like being chased, it can be someone who's quite persistent. Do you see how he has his wand at the, on the map? This person knows what they want and they go and get it. Very confident and bold. They may, they've thought about this. This is not someone who's just um, getting up one day and sending you a message. They've been thinking about you quite a bit. Which is why they may, I was telling you they're buying time. It's because they, they want to be sure about their decision but they are coming towards you with a lot of passion enthusiasm and they're wanting to communicate why is two of wands here i don't need clarification necessarily on two of wands but there the two of wands is usually there's a decision to make but i feel they've made that decision because in their feelings i was seeing the three of wands um so they've picked a direction and that direction is you and they're wanting to come towards you Page of Swords, yeah, to communicate and see sort of where you're at, what you're thinking. Sort of picking at your brain here is what I'm getting. May be very curious, wanting to ask you a lot of questions about you, where you're headed, what you want for yourself for the future. That is sort of where this person's at. Your feelings, we have Ten of Pentacles upright, death in reverse. Yeah, you want commitment. You don't want this to end death in reverse you're emotionally invested and you do see stability moving forward with this person and i think let's see before i talk why is oh, why is ten of pentacles here if you're curious about signs we have cancer aquarius virgo aries leo sagittarius and scorpio coming through why is ten of pentacles in reverse Oh, sorry, not in reverse, upright. Three of Cups. Yeah, this. Some of you may have anxiety. Nine of Swords is letting your thoughts run wild, right? Worrying about what hasn't even happened. Worrying about what could go wrong. Worrying about what has went wrong. Everything, right? 
and you're wanting to perhaps date this person if it's a new energy you're wanting to meet up with them go out for drinks celebrate life you want reunion why is death in reverse here you're both on the same page when it comes to what you want right now you both want to come towards one another but keep in mind it's page energy right why is death in reverse Perhaps there was a lack of recognition or commitment, something where one person felt they were left out and they were doing everything, something along those lines. You have that mindset that you can work through whatever this is, right? But some of you may be resistant to change. Hierophant is five, five in reverse and death in reverse. It's talking about someone who's in their comfort zone and they're afraid perhaps afraid of the unknown. As I say that Eight of Swords, there's some insecurities. You may need more time to think. Hmm, that's what I'm getting in your feelings. You want this, you want friendship, you want this person to be a part of your life, but I'm not sure it's at that commitment stage right now. The obstacle here, Eight of Wands, Upright, Fool, and Reverse. Yeah, someone may be non-committal here for the time being. Um, afraid, fear is getting in the way, and the distance with Eight of Wands. That's what I'm getting here because Eight of Wands is upright, right? If it was in reverse, I'd say there's no forward movement, um, there's bad communication, but clarify Eight of Wands. Two of Cups. The connection remains Aquarius, but the action is what is missing, it seems, with the Fool in reverse because of someone's fear. Yeah, someone's afraid of losing their freedom. So, nine of Cups upright is self-reliant energy, right? Can be you, Aquarius, it can be this person. Afraid of losing one's freedom. But the passion is there, the attraction is there, it's mutual. We have King and Queen of Wands. You're both on the same page for the most part um, when it comes to your interest in one another. Your outcome, we have the world and Nine of Wands. So your guard is up here. You're defending yourself, you're protecting yourself, but <laughs> it's, it's interesting because a part of you I'm getting is just wanting to go and release, right? And just go with the flow. Um, but a part of you is holding back with the Nine of Wands. Nine of Wands and Wounded Warrior. Some of you may be traveling here in your outcome. Why is the world here for Aquarius outcome? Why is, why is the world here? The sense of, yeah, you're letting go of control here. You're not trying to do anything. You're not trying to manipulate the situation. You're surrendering. And some of you feel you, it's not in your control. There's not much you can do. So you're sort of letting it play out. Meanwhile, perhaps focused on your home, um, doing things around the house, your stability. Ooh, some of you can be a bit workaholic, your devil and queen of pentacles. Why is nine of wands an outcome for Aquarius? Why is nine of wands an outcome for Aquarius? Yeah, there's a bit of a dilemma here, which I was picking up on. Part of you is, I don't have control. Perhaps it's that mindset where, okay, I don't have control over this person or how fast things move, but I do have control over myself, my emotions, how much I give. So you may be holding back. See, they're bringing a lot of passion, action, feelings there, but I don't see pentacles. There's there's hope here, Ace of Pentacles, but it's not Ten of Pentacles. It's not King of Pentacles, right? It's just, it's there, but this person has to, with the Knight of Pentacles, be ready and open and willing to give this to you, right? And some of you, this person's just shy with the Page of Cups. There can be a little bit of shyness, but they'll overcome that. The action they're taking, King, King of Wands, very mature energy, right? It's not that the person doesn't see your value or the potential in this connection. They very much do and they're interested, but some of you is just a newer connection. 
So yeah, you're sort of holding back and seeing where things go going with the flow, but you're not really revealing. You're keeping your cards close to your chest. You're not revealing all. In their outcome, we have Sun in reverse and Two of Pentacles upright. They're still confused. They're juggling and this juggling act or indecision has them feeling unhappy. So it's really only harming them. You're kind of, I was getting that in your stance here with the Page of Wands. You know, Page of Wands is ready for adventure, whether you get it with this person or without, you know? So it's, you're not, your life isn't dependent on this situation. You'll easily move on if you have to. You're Queen of Wands and Page of Wands. There's no lack of suitors, admirers when it comes to you. Clarify the sun in reverse for this person's outcome. I want one more. Indecision. Wheel of Fortune upright, Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Two of Pentacles upright, Two of Swords in reverse. Should I go this way? Should I go that way? What do I want to manifest? What do I want moving forward? This person doesn't know what they want moving forward. Clarify the Magician here. I'm getting another scenario here. This person's testing you in some ways to see what you do next and based on how you act they will uh, you know react. But some of you aren't acting. We'll see what you're doing in a sec because I'm curious now. But I think this person may be holding back and waiting to see what your next move is. But whatever they're doing is keeping them stuck and unhappy. Why is Two of Pentacles here for this person's outcome? Why is Two of Pentacles here? Yeah, sh what is this person doing? I was telling you, right? They have this beautiful opportunity in front of them, why isn't it being offered? Page of Pentacles in reverse, they're not giving you anything. But who is this harming? It's harming them and their emotional health. Are they projecting onto you? They were seeing you as the Nine of Cups in reverse. Action is Aquarius taking towards the person on their mind. Yeah, it's on your mind. Um, it may stress you out but you're not taking action hanging man you feel stuck and they feel stuck you may feel it's they need to step up you're both feeling like you may feel it's not in your control they feel they have control but they're not doing anything with that they're give me one more for this person's energy the magician clarify the magician I'm very confused with your outcome. But a lot of this has to do with the confusion surrounding um, your emotions. This person is confused whether they want to be in a relationship or if they want to be single. And they like you, they don't want to lose you, but then I want to have my cake and eat it too. Some of you, this was a, dis a separation. Someone rejected the offer here, um, chose not to move forward, and there was an ending because of one person's lack of action here. Healing heart. A lot of indecision can be... Uh, Aquarius because someone's healing from a past situation as well, right? We had star in their energy, queen of swords. Can be a divorcee here, but it just can be someone who's very hurt. Wants you back, wanted to flip over. I did see love triangle, but I don't see that in your spread.
They want to heal this. Healing heart wants you back. They're moody. Divine timing, yeah. You're the one who's being patient and that's how they were seeing you. You're not in no rush. King of Wands is not known to be the most patient energy though. Don't let love blind you. New love will find you. One more for you, Aquarius. Okay. The truth will be revealed. <laughs> we have making an apology when you least expect it. Reaching a compromise. Can be some some of you, Aquarius. I was saying you're in the page of one's energy. You may be talking to more than one person. Um, very curious energy and quite enthusiastic moving forward. So can be with the emperor in reverse the world and nine of wands you're closing this chapter you're closing yourself off from this person and it's almost when you pull back your energy they come back around wants you back to heal things but there's divine timing at play are, are you wanting to wait temperance and seven of pentacles i never put your life on hold for anyone and i don't think you're doing that this person I don't think this person's seeing you correctly because they're seeing you as temperance seven of pentacles waiting on this that you're very unhappy with the situation but you're still invested in waiting i don't think you are queen of wands and page of wands is a forward movement some of you may find new love and this person will be in for a rude awakening here right with don't let love blind you And I'm not getting this is your energy, Aquarius. It could have been in the past. I'm getting it's this person, 31st. Yeah, look at this. I'm deciding to stay single. I can't handle anything serious at the moment. And a lot of you, it's they're healing from something in their past. But it's that indecision. They want commitment, but they want to be single. What is the person on Aquarius' mind intentions? Not that it can't... Um, it seems very promising, right? I'm only here to help you heal those parts of yourself you've been ignoring for a long time. Trust the process. It's going to take me a few months to come back. Keep your options open. I'm still very confused. Yeah, this sums it up. Just wait and see. I'm going to make it up to you if that's the last thing I do. You see the confusion? I'm moving on. There's no fixing us. Just wait and see. I'm going to make it up to you. Major mood swings. I'm here is Aquarius. This person's not ready for anything committed. But when they are, you will be moving on. And some of you will have moved on with a new love. So. They may be losing out on amazing opportunities. Okay. Let's get you this deck as well. <laughs> yeah, I think this is you. Very childlike with the Page of Wands. Play more. Um, we have Express Yourself more clearly. Some of you do need to work on the communication. <laughs> I wasn't seeing it too strong, but Eight of Wands is coming through as a blockage. It was upright though. But if there is something you're wanting to say, say it. Be clear oh, with this person. Maturity. Yeah, I make peace with the tough relationships of my past. I probably would have skipped the pain they came with, but I'm grateful for the lessons they brought me. World upright in your outcome. Because of those tough relationships, I can look at I can look back at the mosaic of my life and see value in even the most broken pieces. Yeah, I think you are grateful moving forward. Um, if it doesn't work out, you have learned a lot of lessons from this. Yes, that is what I have for you. Um, if you would like to book a personal reading, you can 
check out the description box below. Otherwise, take care of yourself and I'll see you next week. Bye!